Hi everyone, just a really quick video on how to use our brand new colour changing paint set phase. We've also come up with this one which is shift but this video is going to be all about how to use phase. We'll get to shift later, I'll put a little link below on how to use that. So first of all with phase, um, what do you get in the box? That's important. So you get the box and inside it you'll find a few things. You get uh, your instruction card, please read the instructions, there's some important sort of health and safety bits on there. And you get this stuff, which is my Super Base. Um, for those of you that don't know, Super Base was developed to hold more pigment than any other acrylic base medium out there. So we use that to make phase work, and then this stuff. This is absolutely phenomenal. Take a look at this. This pigment mix, Basically, we took the pigment from Purple Haze and the pigment from our Pinkest Pink and we squashed them together to make this, which we call Phase, which is a colour shifting pigment that will change from the purpliest Purple Haze to the Pinkest Pink when it reaches a certain temperature. So, how do you put this stuff together and make awesome things with it? Well, first of all, you need to shovel out um, a spoonful of the phase powder. Now I'm going to mix a little bit, you can mix as much as you need for your work. The thing to remember here is the ratio is 1 to 9. So you're looking for 1 part powder to 9 parts other stuff. Now what we need to do is we need to turn this powder into what we call a dispersion. So we do that by adding a tiny little bit of water and I mean a tiny bit, I mean it's just a little, just enough. And give that a good old mix and you'll find that you can mix that in and you're going to get a really nice purpley pinky kind of uh, paint. And it takes quite a while actually because you really want to work in every little bit of powder to create a really, really good dispersion. But once you've done that and you feel that's quite even, it's time to add the super base to turn it into a really good acrylic paint. So grab your super base and you're gonna want nine spoonfuls of this per one spoonful of, um, of pigment. So using a spoon again, you can measure those out quite accurately actually. There's one. Keep going until you've measured out all nine. And once you've done that, it's just a case of mixing it in. Oh, it's so beautiful, look at that. Okay, great. So that's, that's mixed in and we now have a really beautiful, really smooth colour changing paint. So it's time to apply it to something. Today for the test, I'm going to paint a ping pong ball, um, but it will stick to almost anything. It will stick to metal, it will stick to plastic, it will definitely work on canvas and paper. If you're using a really porous surface, I mean cardboard, wood, that kind of thing, you're going to want to lay down a sealant first. So water-bound PVA glue is really good, or you can use a gesso or um, any other kind of art primer really. Okay, as always, nice soft brush and just a little bit of paint. Don't go chucking paint all over the place. Just a nice little bit of paint and a little goes a long way and start to evenly coat your surface with your mixture. Now I'm going to leave that there for a minute to dry. It will probably need two or three coats to get a nice even coverage. But we're lucky because there's one I've made earlier which I actually keep in the fridge. The reason why I keep it in the fridge is because I want to keep it nice and cool because the colour changes above 28 degrees. So when it gets hot the purple's going to disappear and the pink is pink is going to come out. So in the fridge I have some cupcakes, some strawberries, and 
are colour changing unicorn. Now at the moment, he looks really purple. He is purple haze because he's been chilling out in the fridge. So let's, let's have a look with the hairdryer and add a little bit of heat to watch that purple disappear and see the pink come through. There he goes. Wow. Look at that. And you can see the pinkest pink coming through and that purple disappearing and an absolutely gorgeous colour changing phase shift there. So, isn't that beautiful? So there he is, an absolutely beautiful, colour changing, purple haze to pinkest pink uni unicorn. So obviously you're going to let this reach its own temperature by leaving it in a room or putting it in the sun or whatever. We've just sped up the process so you can see what it's supposed to do. I'm really, really excited to see what you make with this stuff. I don't know what you're going to come up with, but I hope it's really, really useful. A couple of things. Um, this stuff's really durable. It's strong, thanks to the super base. It's not 100% waterproof, you're not going to dip it underwater, but it's pretty water resistant. So this is going to be great if you want to paint your guitar, you want to paint your skateboard, uh, maybe you want to make a colour changing toilet seat, I don't know. Um, surprise me, share the work you make with the hashtag CultureHustle. Um, check out the video below on how to use Shift, the other colour changing product. I love you, thank you, bye.